how many animals can you see? The first riddle might look like a basic children's puzzle, but nothing is as simple as it seems here. Look closely and count how many animals you see in this picture. It looks like one elephant to me, but maybe you'll have better luck in 10 seconds. Time's up. Let's see what we've got here. There's obviously an elephant, a donkey, a dog, a kitty cat, and a mouse. The trickier ones are a tail of a snake, a mosquito, and a tortoise. And now, the top-level agents hiding in here are a crocodile, a dolphin, a fish, right there in the eye, a bird's head, and a prawn. If you found one to three creatures in the drawing, Maybe you simply didn't have enough time, because that's not even half of them, you know? If you ended up with four to six creatures on your list, you spotted the most obvious ones, but still missed quite a few. Did you manage to see seven to nine animals, birds, and insects here? Well, your attention to detail is very good. So close to perfect. It must help you out in life quite a lot. Finally, if you saw 10 to 13 creatures in between the mess, congratulations! You could be an FBI agent, or perhaps you already are. But you probably wouldn't share that in the comments below, so we'll never know, right? Moving on to the next test. Which color is the brightest? Look at this beautiful painting. If you can name the style it was created in, you're an art expert. And that was the final test for today. Just kidding. Which color looks like the brightest and most dominant here? If you think it's A, dark blue, you're a perfectionist. You're also independent, analytical, and a high achiever. If it's B, yellow, you're adaptable, easygoing, and laid back. Finally, if you picked C, light blue, you're a creative thinker, an action-oriented person, and a risk-taker. What do you see first? Another riddle of this kind. So, what do you see first? If it's clearly a face to you, you're most definitely sensitive and kind, which is why you like to avoid conflicts. You have truly phenomenal intuition, and this helps you out in so many situations. If it's two birds that you see first, you are a warm-hearted and fun-loving individual. You have great people skills, and you're a great friend and good listener. You most likely have a job that involves dealing with other people. If you're still deciding which career path to choose, that would be your best choice. Can you spot the hidden animal? Oh my! It must be a chameleon out there because it's so well hidden between the rocks. I'll give you five seconds to figure it out. Are you ready to be amazed? It's Harry Potter's best friend. No, not Ron Weasley, the other one. It's an owl. Can you find the mistake? This sequence of letters looks so much like the Da Vinci Code, but something in the code is wrong. Can you figure it out in five seconds? The answer is simple. One X is missing from the sequence. Find the odd one out. Time for a colorful break from psychology. No hidden meanings here, but there's a figure that's clearly the odd one out. You've got five seconds for the task. And done. So the creature that doesn't belong here is a puppy. You don't eat those, right? but I personally wouldn't mind a bite of everything else I see here. What do you see first? What do you see riddles are fun, aren't they? Short, simple, and they give accurate psychological portraits. So let's do another one. If this looks like a village with huts, birds, and trees to you, you value traditions and prefer a simple and peaceful style of life. 
If you saw no village but an elephant at first glance, you are respectful to others, loyal to your friends, and a great listener. You are loving, caring, and thoughtful. And that's why so many people love you. Find the odd one out. Look at all the G's out there. Let me try to read it. Okay, enough of that. Something's telling me one of these letters is nothing like the others. Can you find it in five seconds? So, Eagle Eyes, did you spot the odd one out here? It's a B, right there. What do you see first? Another what do you see first riddle. Again, just go with your first impression. Do you see a bright explosion? Then you're a good organizer and a perfect leader. You like to be in charge and you aren't afraid to face the music. If this drawing looks like two hands to you, you must be interested in understanding and helping people. You are a great listener who truly cares about the problems of others. Can you spot the hidden animal? That looks like a bunch of autumn leaves to me. Or is it? Can you see who's hiding here? Time's up. Do you know the answer, fellow brightsiders? It's a chameleon. By the way, if you think chameleons actually change their color to hide from enemies or danger, you're wrong. They do it to communicate with others of their kind and to regulate their body temperature. As it becomes lighter, a chameleon cools down since it reflects the sun's rays more efficiently. Going darker has the opposite effect. And now that our biology break is over, let's move over to the next test. What do you see first? Look at this beautiful drawing right here. It would make a nice tattoo, wouldn't it? We won't make you spot objects here. Just answer one simple question. What do you see first? I'm not giving you any time to think it over. Just go with the first idea you get. If this drawing is a gorilla to you, it characterizes you as an independent person who values personal space and me time. Teamwork and asking others for advice can be helpful too. But as long as you're comfortable being the only decision maker in your life, keep it that way. If you see a tiger here, you're a risk taker. Nothing is impossible if you have something in mind and you can find practical solutions to nearly any problem. Go you! What do you see first? Ready to learn some more truths about yourself? The final what do you see first test for today is here for you. If you saw a bra, you're impatient, enjoy every moment, and love a new experience. You only live once could be your bumper sticker. Keep going like this for as long as you enjoy it. Did you see Spider-Man in the picture? That means you're traditional, stable, and calm. You don't like to take unnecessary risks. In fact, any risks make you feel uncomfortable. It's okay to sometimes step off the path you know well to spice up your life. 